Hey everybody, it is AJ and it's a something to do Saturday and we've got a fun one this week. We're going to be all over Ashtabula County. I'm going to give you 10 places to visit that are fun and exciting for the whole family. So it's a something to do Saturday, which means I'm going to... Hey mom, what you doing? I'm um, trying to shoot a video. <laughs> I got a lot to do today. Why, what's up? You want to hang out, don't you? A little bit. Uh, I really don't have time. I got to finish the video, okay? So um, let me... Let me try shooting this video and if I get done in time, I can go, okay? Okay. All right, so let me start again. Hey everybody, it's AJ. It is a something to do Saturday and we have a fun one for you today because we are gonna be visiting cool places in Ashtabula County. So I'm gonna try and give you 10 tips in 10 minutes or less on all the funnest places right here in Ashtabula County. Hey AJ, hey. are you busy? Um, a little bit. Oh, well, can we meet with, to talk about a few things? Yes. Hang on guys, I'll be back. Hey everybody, it's AJ. It is a something to do Saturday and we are gonna do 10 tips in 10 minutes or less on AJ, fun things. you yes. have a call that's super important. Okay, <laughs> hang on. Actually, this week, I'm gonna take you along all around Asheville County for the 10 tips and tricks. We'll do it for, come on, let's go. All right, how about a stop at Conneaut Creek or Indian Mound Metro Park? Here, you can walk or play in the water. It's fun for you, you and those furry friends, or you and the whole family. As one of Ohio's scenic waterways, you can come down to the creek, bring those furry friends, your dogs, to play and splash, or the kids. And you can also fish. If you're looking for more to do, check out one of our previous videos with AJ's Out and About, or last year we came down here with leader, Asheville Leadership's Kelly Jones and our friends from ODNR, and they'll give you even more things to do down here. How awesome is that? Did you know that Asheville County has 19 covered bridges? Holy cow, is that a lot. Right behind me is actually the longest in the US. And fun fact, we also have the shortest in the US, in Geneva. How awesome is that? So besides seeing some gorgeous covered bridges, here you can play in the river, and there is a beautiful paved path, which we'll go see in a second, that you can walk dogs, kids, everybody. It's a whole family adventure here. So this trail that I'm standing on right here is actually smooth and paved, and it leads all the way down to the river's edge. Right in downtown Ashtabula, behind the Cedar Quest ball fields, we have the Indian Trails Park on some gorgeous paved walking paths that are great for kids and dogs, so you can bring everybody. Here we also are going to try and see some gorgeous scenery and hopefully some water. Let's go. We found the water. If you follow the walking trail all the way down, you will find this gorgeous waterfall. It's especially really pretty after really good rain, like we just had. If waterfalls aren't really your thing, that's okay. All along the trail, you can also see the river and there's some nice little paths to get you down so you can play in there as well. It's really great for the whole family. If you're like me, you like a little education and history anywhere you go. So you can actually take the walking path right up to the river's edge 
and you can see the bridge where in 1876 was the great Ashtabula train disaster where the bridge actually collapsed. It's a really cool piece of history right here in our county. Need a sweet treat in the middle of the day or to end your day? Well, we are here at one of the local spots, the Wimpy Zip. It's a favorite among library staff, just ask Beth. It's one of the best ones around. Come on, let's go. Oh my gosh, there are so many choices. How do I decide? You can even have fun while you're waiting for your ice cream. Okay, so we are here at one of the stops on the Greenway Trail. This one is the one right on Woodman Avenue. Did you know that the Greenway Trail consists of 44 miles with 27 of them being in Asheville County? That's more than half. How cool is that? Let's go check some of it out. So here we are on the Greenway Trail. How gorgeous is this? Since this week I took over, I have someone else. This is my friend Kayla, and she's gonna tell us her favorite thing to do on the trail. So Kayla, you can run, walk, bike, take the dogs and the kids. Mm -hmm. Out of all of that, what's your favorite thing to do? I really love to come here to bike and run. It's nice and flat. It goes on literally forever. Like it's really great for runs and biking. See, she said she loves to bike. Kayla, could you bike the whole 27 miles? Probably not now. I wish. You don't have to bike the whole 27 miles or walk or run it to have fun. If you want to take a break from your physical activity, because I know I would, you can read all about the Underground Railroad in Asheville County, educational and historical. How cool is that? What's really cool is also near Walnut Beach is the Hubbard House, which is a museum that talks all about the historical movements that Asheville County did during that time. So you get some physical activity and education. Your brain is gonna love that. And it's all fun. We are here at Walnut Beach, one of Ashtabula's beaches, and this is one of my favorites. So here you can do all kinds of stuff. You see the beautiful water behind me. And you see all the people swimming and having fun. So it is free. And if you've watched my mom's videos, you know we love free. So you can swim, kayak, you can drive your boat out here if you got one of those. If you look this way, you can actually see the lighthouse and the oh, Who doesn't love that? You don't have much of summer left. So come down here and enjoy it while you can. Alright, we are here in Ashtabula Harbor at the famous Bridge Street. Who doesn't love Bridge Street? So behind me you can see the gorgeous lake again with our awesome bridge. Who, who else has a bridge like that? So now we're gonna go explore some of the, the fun that you can do on Bridge Street. Let's go check it out. There we go. So right now I am standing in the historic Bridge Street in Asheville's Harbor. How gorgeous is this? And I have my awesome smoothie by Harbor Park, which is right over there. There is so much to do here. You can shop, eat, and just kind of explore. It's great for you, date night, or with the family. It's fun for everyone. Here at Lakeshore Park, another one of Asheville's beautiful beaches. This one has some awesome beaches and water for you. But wait, there's more. This way, there's a playground for the kids. How fun is that? And some adults too, especially if you like hanging out with my mom. <laughs> so we got playground here for the kids and water. Can you get any more family fun than that? 
I don't think so. But wait, there's even more! Not only at Lakeshore Park can you swim at the beach and play on the playground, but there's a whole other part that you don't even have to have a swimsuit for. There's beautiful animals, including this guy right here, and Ohio's bird, or at least it should be, and this beautiful pond. This is all great for a nice evening stroll or just a midday break. Whatever you want, it's right here. Field Bridge. Look at the gorgeous bridge behind me and I am standing here in the beautiful Grand River at the Township Park and there is so much to do. So besides the gorgeous river, there's also a playground for your young ones or your ones that are young at heart. And how fun is this? At the back of the park, there's also a nice walking trail. It's paved and accessible for everyone. How awesome is that? Kids, families, dogs, and even wheelchairs. How cool. And if walking's not really your thing, that's okay. Because all around the park, there are gorgeous swings. You can sit, wait for your party, and have a Here at the library, there's something for everyone. We have adult programs like cricket classes, we have kid programs, story times, and even family fun programs like summer Saturdays and movies in the park. Here at the library, there's something for everyone all the time. Well, I hope you had fun today. Hey, Kate, what you doing? I finished your video for you. What? Yeah. Did you do 10 tips in 10 minutes or less? I think we did. I hope so. Thanks. I guess that only leaves. See, See you real, real soon. soon. Want more information? The library's got you covered. We got all kinds of books, starting with our one tank trips with the Ohio Road Trip Guide. And especially in Ashville County, who doesn't love it? The wineries. Perfect for summer reading, ghost stories and tales, and fun for the whole family in and around the county. Check it out. So here we are on the green, is it center? <laughs> you know, now that I'm like thinking about it, I don't know if it's center. It didn't look center. <laughs> Alright, let's try it now. Oh. <laughs> oh wait, I can flip it. Oh. I forgot about that. Oh yeah, it's been running. Okay. All right. <laughs> I'm just gonna look through the five minutes of us just like. I love this. Okay. We're just gonna let it run, and she can edit it out. Okay. 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 Okay.